let me teach you how to make meat pie without an oven or even a cutter hello beautiful people welcome to my channel so we start by making our filling for our meat pie filling i have my irish potato carrots meat meat green bell pepper i have my seasoning and salt i have my curry powder i have dry pepper i have spring onions and i have some chopped ginger garlic and onions so to start with i start by boiling my irish potato so i had that support i had some water i'm going to cover this allow this to boil for a few minutes after a few minutes this is what i have so i'm just going to take that from the heat and drain the water so i'm going to go ahead and eat up some vegetable oil then i'm going to add my chopped ginger garlic and onions allow that to fry for a few minutes then later i go ahead and add my minced meat so i stir that together allow that to stir fry for some minutes then i'm going to go ahead and add my dry pepper so once i had my dry pepper i'm just going to mix that together So after some minutes, I had my seasoning and salt. Then I stir everything together. I also go ahead and add my curry powder and I'm going to stir that together. So I'll go ahead and add some water to this. Then I'm going to cover this, allow that to cook. While that is cooking, I go ahead and prepare my thickener and for my thickener, I'm using flour and water. So I had two tablespoons of flour and three tablespoons of water. You can also use corn flour as well. So just mix that together and set it aside. Next, I check back on my meat mixture and this is what I have. So the next thing I'll be adding now is my Irish potato and carrot. So after adding this mixture together, I'm going to stir everything together. So you stir everything until everything is well combined. Next, I'm going to add a little bit of water just to loosen it up a little bit. Then I'm going to cover that to steam for a few minutes. I don't want to overcook it. So after some minutes, this is what I have. So I'm just going to stir that together and our meat my filling is almost ready. The next I'm adding now is my green bell pepper. So I had my green pepper, then I'm going to go ahead and add my thickener, the flour mixture I made earlier. So I'm going to add that and stir that together. You can see our filling is ready and can you see how lovely it is. So the next thing I'm going to add, which is the last thing I'm adding, is my spring onions. So I'm just going to add that spring onions, then I'm going to turn off the heat. So at this point, my meat pie filling is ready. Can you see how juicy and lovely it is? So you set that aside. Then next, we move to our meat pie dough. And for my meat pie dough, I'm using flour, sugar, baking powder, water, and margarine. So I'll be leaving all the ingredients and the measurements in the description box please check so i'm just going to go ahead and combine all my ingredients together so i'm sieving in my baking powder inside my flour i've sieved my flour already so always make sure you sieve your flour next that i'm adding now is my margarine so i'm going to go ahead and mix in my margarine together with my flour until everything is well combined once you mix your flour and butter together that everything is looking like this as in well combined like this you can see what i have in this video then the next thing you start adding your water bit by bit so you add your water and then you mix everything together just keep on adding your water little by little and you keep on mixing everything so once you finish adding your water you are going to transfer that onto your work surface and you start to knead it together you knead this until a dough is formed At this point, my meat pie dough is completely ready. So I'm just going to go ahead and wrap this with my clean film and then I'm going to set this aside. Next, I'm going to go ahead and prepare my pan. So for my pan, I'm going to line this 
with my baking paper so i'm just going to cut out the size of the baking pan from the baking paper then once i finish cutting that i'm going to add some margarine inside my baking pan then i'll rub that margarine all over the baking pan then i'm going to put my liner that is the baking paper then i'll use it to line inside the pan still rub some margarine and that is it my baking pan is ready and this will serve as our baking tray then we arrange the meat pie inside so this will be the round cutter i'll be using to cut my meat pie you can use any round shape cutter you have at all anything that is round so next i'll bring out my meat pie dough then i'm just going to cut it a little portion i'll work little by little with it so i'm just going to go ahead and sprinkle a little bit of flour on my work surface and i'm going to knead that back to form a round dough again so once that is done i'm just going to go ahead and roll it out so i'm not going to roll it to be too thin or too flat then once i finish rolling it out i'm going to use the cutter to cut it out so once I finish cutting it out, I'm going to go ahead and remove every excess that I have. Then the excess, we are still going to roll back the excess. Oh. So you had your meat pie filling. Please don't have too much of your filling because if you have too much of your filling, it's going to split out. So you just add little of that to one side of the meat pie. Then you use water to seal the edge properly. Then you just close it very well. Then you go ahead and get a fork. Then you use that fork to imprint or to mark the edge of the meat pie. As you can see what I am doing in this video. And that's it. Our meat pie is ready. And that's just all we have to do. Then I'm just going to arrange this in my prepare baking pan and that's it so i'm just going to repeat this same process for the rest of the meat pie dough again If you enjoyed this video and you are here to subscribe to this channel please subscribe to this channel because on my channel i share amazing recipe that you are definitely going to love and enjoy and once you subscribe don't forget to turn on your notification bell so that when i drop a new video you will be notified and also don't forget to like and share this video and leave some comments on that this video what do you think about this video so once i finish cutting all my meat pie this is what i have so the next i'm going to do right now is to egg wash this with egg so after egg washing my meat pie then i'll go ahead and bake it but this time around we are not using oven i'm using pot so inside the pot i place a stainless pot then i put the baking pan on top of it the pot has already been created so after that i cover that with foil paper just to trap the heat inside so then we leave this to bake for one hour or once your meat pie is ready so guys my meat pie is ready and this is what i have will you be trying this method let me know in the comment section and my beautiful people this is my meat pie so guys till i come your way in my next video keep believing in yourself thank you guys for watching bye bye